welcome. Come on in, come on, come on. Don't be shy. I wanted to bring you in and show you my at-home showroom. I display a few bags up here, as you can see. I get a lot of inspiration in this room. This is kind of my space in my head, externalized into an actual room. So over here I have some art from my favorite artist of all time, Patrick Nagel. I have another Nagel hiding in here. And I just kind of come in here to display what I have, feel creative, and take most of my photographs and do a lot of my editing. So over here, I have a beautiful bag on a reflective circle. Oh, oh, there's a little, a little bit of dust. No. Not okay, we're perfectionists here. And what I will do is I will snap photos. And look, look at that. It's dancing for you. Otherwise, I have some old equipment in here that I'm still holding on to. I have my old sewing machine, a few other machines I would use, a skiving machine. They need to be rehomed. I don't do like making my bags anymore. I don't do them myself, but I come up with my prototypes and then I have those made in Singapore. So I have a few styles up here and a few colors. If you come over to this one in particular, this one is a calf leather, gold hardware, my little D insignia on the top, and this is a genuine American alligator handle. Stunning bag. I'll show you what it looks like when we open it up too. It also comes with a strap. And here is the logo hardware. Gorgeous. And I'll have these out, and then I'll also have a few other bags, color options that I keep in stock down here. Of course, everything comes with society certificates, dust bags, and I ship with FedEx for US shipping. I cannot ship outside the US, unfortunately, uh, if there's exotic. If it's non-exotic, then yes, of course, I can ship outside the US. I'm trying to think what else I can show you. Ooh, um, where did I put it? Check it out. Ooh, I can get a bite. And over here on this wall, I have an American alligator hanging out. This one is in the glazed finish. He's obviously the color black. And the quickest way to tell the difference between an alligator and a crocodile is there are no holes in the tiles. So we have a smooth surface in kind of an irregular pattern. But if you look at crocodile, this one is Nilotticus, you will find tiny hole indentations in each of the tiles in a slightly less irregular pattern. I don't have a favorite in case you're wondering. I like alligator, crocodile. I just find that they're beautiful in different ways. So I hope you enjoy this quick tour of my showroom and I hope you have a great day. Thanks for watching. Bye.